Hi everyone, welcome back to Gado. Today we will show you how to replace the Taptic engine on the iPhone 12 mini mobile phone. Before starting, we need the right tools to proceed with the repair which you can find in the description. First, turn off the phone and remove the SIM tray. And then undo two bottom screws by using a Pentolop screwdriver. To take out the screen, first apply some heat to soften the glue on the screen. For this, we are using a heating pad. Alternatively, use a heat gun or hair dryer. And then lift the screen. For that, we need a suction cup or something similar. In here, we are using a double sided suction cup to lift the front assembly. If not, you can use a regular suction cup to raise the screen and a plastic cup pry tool or triangle picker to separate and loosen up rubber gaskets on the frame. Lift the screen and keep the direction like opening a book. And then remove the screw to take out the shield. And then undo the battery plug. Next, on top undo 5 screws to take out the bracket. And then disconnect the screen and the earpiece SMD plug. Now you can free the screen from the body. Next, take out the bracket by undoing two screws. Next, undo two more screws. And then disconnect the Taptic engine connector. Next, gently pull out the not working Taptic engine from the body. Next, place the new Taptic engine on the board. Next, connect the plug and secure two screws. Next, place the bracket and then secure two screws. Next, place the front screen on the body. First, connect the earpiece SMD plug and then the LCD connector plug. And finally, the battery plug to the board. And also, secure the brackets by adding screws. Next, to clamp up the phone, click on the top section first, then simultaneously click the sides and the bottom. Just make sure to put pressure on the frame sides. Next, insert the SIM tray and then add two screws in the bottom.
Hope you have enjoyed the replacement guide. Let us know if you have any questions. Please like, share and comment on our videos. Hit the subscribe button for more videos.